Hey guys, today we're going to talk about the NEO phone and the impact it will have on the NEO stock price. So what do we know about the phone so far? So we know it's going to be an Android phone with two SIM cards. And other than that, there's really nothing else we know about it, right? However, they have finally gotten the approval of the Chinese government to actually start selling this phone. So most of the time when a phone manufacturer wants to release a new phone, they have to go through some regulatory approval, right? They have to show that the phone actually works and isn't doing things they're not supposed to be doing. And the NEO phone, actually got the approval last month and usually in about a month's time after receiving this approval they actually released the phone so it's going to be relatively soon that the phone is going to be released uh, when you're looking at the data of other manufacturers right so i'm expecting the neo phone to actually be released or at least announced by the end of this month and beginning of september i'm expecting it to be in the stores so what's the purpose of this phone actually right so the purpose of this phone is to essentially enhance the user experience so neo is all about the user experience and they want to create this ecosystem and that's why it's very hard to actually have apple uh, carplay in the neo car they don't like that very much because then you're using the Apple ecosystem. So by introducing their own phone, they can actually tailor it more to have it be uh, better for car use, right? So that's essentially what Neo is going to try and do, is going to enhance the user experience by allowing the compatibility of your phone to the car and having a better dashboard. How would this impact the Neo stock price, right? So I actually think that the stock price has more upside potential than downside potential from this phone release right because nobody's actually anticipating any gains in revenue or earnings per share that is significant enough to really move the stock price from selling phones no analyst report or no investor report that i have read so far is actually pricing in any significant gain in revenue or in earnings per share coming from the phone sales so if the phones are relatively good price and are actually good phones and are selling better than people will have anticipated, this could actually drive the stock price much, much higher, right? However, if, if the phones really do not sell at all, it really doesn't hurt the stock that much, in my opinion, because no one is actually expecting it to do well. So you actually have more upside potential from here. However, I do think it's relatively small compared to other things we have seen in the past, right? It's kind of an add-on product to the cars, right? The cars are still the main business and the battery swap is still the main business. So that is essentially what we should be looking for. However, the phones are something that's an add-on and could boost uh, the revenue and the earnings we share a little bit to actually help profitability, right, of Neo, which is very important. So let me know in the comments what you think of the Neo phone or if you're even getting it. I might be getting it uh, depending on the price, of course, and if it's actually a good phone. Now, I will do an unboxing video for you guys if I do end up getting it. So please like and subscribe. That would help me tremendously. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching.